Imperion is harder than freaking Bloodlust or something. This level is ridiculously hard for seven stars. This is not a seven star level. Oh my gosh. Just look at Darwin's part here. Look at this. Just look, look at this ship here. I frequently have trouble with this ship. Like, <laughs> there's spikes on them. Honestly. The hardest part about Chase's part is that is the UFO timing with those three three portals in a row. The rest is pretty easy. The ship kind of reminds me of the beginning of Sidestep, though. Still haven't beaten that. Don't know if I will. Don't know if I want to, honestly. I'm trying to beat this because, you know, last in the magic gauntlet. I never beat- this isn't a rebeat or anything, I just never beat it, because this level is ridiculously annoying. Worse than one in that one map- worse than the level titled one, like the number one in that one map pack somewhere. It is actually the worst. I mean, it's a good level, they did good, but... Rob Top, the difficulty is not seven stars. See? See? The block moves straight into my ship. My... The bottom of... What the, the bottom of my space trap craft got impaled and went through my head. Or the spike did. I feel like these colors are every time... Are different every time I go through here and it's weird. Even though they're not. These things need to stop moving around. Spikes, get into your proper place. Like, oh shoot, he's here. Oh, now they're just moving back and forth. Okay. What even? Imagine making an extreme demon where all the spikes are sliding back and forth, and there's no arrow, so you have no idea when to jump. And it lasts for like three minutes. And it's not even decorated. That would be the best extreme demon. Thank you, Music Sync, for being good here. This part is annoying because there's a duel, an uneven duel, and you don't put those in quote-unquote seven-star levels. Why, I, you know, I forgot to comment on this. There's a freaking copyrighted, like, Minecraft enchanted book just chilling in the sky. <laughs> like, ugh, what? What is that supposed to mean? Oh, I hate that. There's a tiny little spike there. You have to be upside down to get through there. This level's actually the worst sometimes. Like, look at that ship transition. You don't put that in a seven star level. Nor do you put Mr. Cool Tricks' part here. And oh my gosh, the final part, and Lex's, is the worst. And I forgot to tap. It is ridiculously hard. Like, demon difficulty. It's stupid. <laughs> I was doing a practice run right before recording, and I'm like, and Lex, why? I'm stupid. <sighs> the sink is pretty good, especially in Chase's part. 
I don't think Dansman would be proud of all this glow, though. <laughs> so this should be renamed to the Glow Gauntlet purely because it's the Magic Gauntlet. That was actually really close. <laughs> Almost died. <laughs> Almost got impaled by a spike. It's a fun feeling. Like, you don't, you just don't put that kind of thing. Ooh, that was close. Oh. Yeah, I haven't gotten over 75. Of course, Enlux's part is like right after that, and it lasts it lasts for a fourth of the level, unless there's something in between that. Yeah, the, the colors are different, just like the TT2. Come on. Oh, that was close with that robot jump. Oh, those transitions are so annoying. Hello. I tapped, did I not? Yeah, I did. Thanks for not responding. <laughs> Go away, Minecraft book. I get it, you're a magic book. Who cares, but you're distracting me. Hence the commentary. Oh, that was close. Why? Why did I tap? Oh my gosh. Ugh. <sighs> I want to slap Viper in for making this level. Honestly. Like, do you know seriously? Actually, no. Correction, I want to slap Rob Top for rating this freaking seven stars and putting it in the gauntlet. I can beat freaking Insanity in Future Funk. I can do this. But it's just... Mm, it, I can't even find the right words to describe it. Does no count as a good describing word? Just... No. Yeah, that's what I get for singing. <laughs> this glow is oddly nice. You'd expect Darwin to have more, though. <laughs> Ooh, maybe I could try and take on Quantum Variation. This is my next super hard demon. Mm, what did I hit? Stupid invisible spikes. Maybe I could try Quantum Variation as next as my hard demon. I've got, I think my best was 42% on it. I was messing around with it for a while. Back in like January, February. <laughs> Shoot. 
shoot. I was like, no tap. And I didn't tap. Not even after I died. Spending forever on this stupid seven star level. No, <laughs> oh my gosh. I forgot to tap again. I suck. I won't do it again. Come on. Go. That was kind of close. One more time. I forgot to... <laughs> this is why I hate the level. Because it's freaking four times. <laughs> You can't see anything. And the portals come rushing at you as if they relate to the party. It's like, oh yeah, we have a job to do. This blocks me living like, oh shoot. He's here. That's how you input comedy to levels like this that are annoying. Just look at how the box moves and make something up with it. I didn't even realize what I was doing for a moment. I don't even know what's happening, to be honest. Oh, did I beat I beat it. Alright. <laughs> that took long enough, honestly. 24 minutes. AFK. <laughs> it should not be 7 stars. I feel cheated. Alright, well, it is Heldium. <laughs> Goodbye with this.